Now, in today's reading, Ezekiel chapter 23, I need to give a bit, well, I guess, of a disclaimer. As you're reading through this chapter, you could say it's rated PG-13. I would say it's more rated R. It's very intense. And in this chapter, the two kingdoms of Israel are explained, typified, kind of used in an analogous way of these two sisters, these two sisters who are given over to their lusts, their idolatry, and their passions. And as you read through the chapter, you're gonna see that there is a strong call to repentance from God. Repentance from what, you might ask? Well, you see, these two sisters left their faithful spouse to go and be with others. And over and over again throughout the Old Testament, this is how God feels about his people. He wants their heart. Not given over to idolatry or any other master passion of their life, but a relationship with him. You see, you are a created being and you will find your greatest place of satisfaction in life when you are going after your creator. But if you don't, if you so choose to go after another passion, well, God would see that as idolatry of the heart. And listen to how this chapter ends. Let me just read a little bit of verse 49 from Ezekiel chapter 23. You will suffer the full penalty and you will know that I'm the sovereign Lord. You see, actions have consequences. And if you go after that, which promises what it can never produce, well, as this would say here, you'll suffer the penalty for idolatry. Today, seek the Lord, live for him with your heart, with your head, with your hands, with your whole being. Follow after your creator. He is the one who satisfies your soul. And he is truly the greatest pursuit of your life, knowing God and making him known.